Hello my friends and welcome back to my device YouTube channel. If you want to keep your browsing secure and private in 2025, you need a reliable VPN. So in today's video, I will introduce you the best free VPN for PC, whether you are using Windows or Mac. So actually this VPN will help you to stay anonymous online uh, and uh, access to restricted content or even for a streaming. So let's say that started and see which VPN is the best for you. First of all, open up your web browser and go to this URL, jeff.io. As you can see here, here you see the main page of the website. As you can see here, we have a download option for Android, directly Android actually file, Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Depends on operation system which you use, uh, you can select your download option, just tap on the icon. Now I will select Windows and as you can see here it's for Windows 7 and above I mean Windows 8, Windows 11 or Windows 10 Actually the size of program is about 12 MB so it's easy to download Just a start the download After the program is completely downloaded go to download folder and try to install it it's so easy guys, just right click on the downloaded file and select run as administrator choose your language, choose your path next, next and turn on this option it doesn't take much time to install just finish it now it's time to work with Jeff VPN again right click run as administrator let me allow this program it's because of my actually firewall now here first of all you should uh, if you have a user of course you don't have so here click on create a new account it's so easy guys one of the interesting thing is that uh, this VPN doesn't need uh, actually any email address and verify your email address just uh, type your username and your password and security code there is an important point guys here uh, that i must tell you if you use lowercase or uppercase letter in your username later if you want to log in in your username you must type it in the same way for example if you assert your username with a capital letter you must type it in the same way later if you type it all in lowercase letters, the program will not accept it and log into your username. So I always actually type my username, all of them with lowercase. Now just type your security code and click on register. Unfortunately, I got this error. I should change my username. Let me change it again click on register and here guys as you can see we made a account for Jeff the interesting thing is that you will not receive any message that you have created a username you just need to click on the login and enter to your account just wait and here as you can see this is the interface of Jeff VPN. Just wait and be patient guys and watch this video I will tell you all of the option of this VPN. The first option is the notification option where the app itself will share a series of messages with you about new features and other things. So there is a no important point guys so we will go to another option. This section shows the volume of your data when you are connected to the VPN and you are browsing the internet. The download volume, the upload volume, as well as the ping rate and the protocol you are using. And here is the important section. Here you have option to change your language as you can see here. There is a four language here. And here you can change your term from light to dark and from dark to light. Here you can see three options, network level VPN, which you can tunnel all of your system 
with Jeff and exclude PRC traffic it's for actually Chinese user and auto configure proxy which actually set your proxy on your web browser automatically in this section you can choose which ports Jeff will use or choose from the default ports and you can choose the ports of other programs for Jeff and you can also allow other computers or users to use Jeff actually you don't need to uh, change the ports so don't touch them and go to another option pay attention guys this option is the most important part of Jeff because in this option you can see if your country has blocked Jeff from this option you can choose the bridge and connect your VPN easily and next option as you can see protocol if your VPN doesn't connect or it becomes difficult to connect you can switch between these protocols and connect your VPN easily so we have nothing to do here and we will go to the main page here when you click on change location you can see all of the location which you can uh, access to them here you will find free servers and paid servers that you can choose from them when you click here you can find all of the free servers here as you can see there are a lot of them and you can choose them based on the ping this part which is grayed out are the paid servers that you need to buy Jeff subscription to be able to use and here you can see the free servers the numbers shown in front of server show the loud of the servers what percentage is filled and how many users are connected to them the lower number shows the better speed after choosing your server just click on connect and wait it could be takes couple of the seconds guys just be patient and wait here we are guys as you can see we have successfully connected to one of the Jeff's free server and now I will show you its speed as you can see guys you can easily surf the internet with full security and ease in my opinion guys you don't need to buy paid subscriptions and free subscriptions are enough now let me test the YouTube after you are done with the VPN you can easily disconnect it now I will tell you how to buy uh, paid subscriptions just uh, click on buy plus and wait as you can see guys there are many options for buying one of which I always use is buying with cryptocurrencies so just choose your payment method and click on check out and here you have an option for uh, mounts a year two year or about three years and you can easily order and check out one more time I will tell you how to do that just click on change location and here depends on your uh, actually country or your ping speed select your server and just uh, click on connect and wait and finally let me show you this part when you connect your VPN you can evaluate and see your data volume here so here you can see your download speed upload service latency and your IP address and your port and your protocol which you are using now so here is nothing left to say my friends thank you for watching this video and if it helped you please like it and tell me your experience and your opinion about that and uh, don't forget that my friends to subscribe my channel to don't actually lost my channel see you soon guys be careful of yourself goodbye